So to set up a Google Ads Manager account, you're going to go to ads.google.com and you're going to sign up for a free account. Now, one thing about Google Ads is you're going to be creating ads from keywords. We're doing search ads. We're also going to be doing display ads. Uh, display ads are similar to Facebook ads in which you have like a picture and then you might have um, some text that goes with it. But for the most part, it's just going to be a picture. They click on it and then they visit your link. So you're going to type in your business name. We'll talk more about this later in the advanced lessons um, where we'll talk about keywords and how to use keywords. If you already know how to use keywords, you can just skip that, uh, that lesson. But we're going to put in our website. It's going to give us an example of where um, what our customers will see whenever they visit our website. And so right here, we have the option to select a goal. You can get more calls, you can get more visits, you can get more views on YouTube, but for now we're just going to stick with website sales or leads. And so we're going to hit next. And we will end up, uh, we have to accept the policies. And so now it's going to ask us to write uh, an ad. So it's going to give us some ideas of what we should use here. Um, one thing I just want to point out is that you want to keep the title to a certain length. You don't want it to be too long because then people have to read this huge title. It's just not great. Um, but we're not going for uh, right now. I'm not trying to explain how to do that just yet. Right now, we're just kind of going over the uh, <clears throat> process of creating this account. So it's going to ask you to add some keyword themes. You can select more themes if you'd like. I just stuck with the sales funnel software here. Um, it should give you some pretty good suggestions. Um, you can type in a uh, zip code. So now it's going to ask you to set an, a budget, which is going to be recommended for you. <clears throat> That's a uh, 780. It's not bad. That's kind of low for by some people's standards, but um, it's a good place to start. And then it's going to ask you to add your card details. <clears throat> it's going to offer you um, a, a credit. Um, but that credit, you have to just make sure you understand that that credit is only whenever you spend a certain amount. <clears throat> so moving forward, uh, we're not going to do this right now, but we're going to skip to the dashboard. And so here, this is where whenever your campaigns are running, you'll see your analytics, your clicks, your impressions, your CPC, how much you've spent. And you can, uh, you can click on campaigns on the left. See, we've got the same sort of um, the levels that we saw on Facebook where you've got campaigns, ad groups, and ads. Um, and you can always visit the recommendations area <clears throat> if you just need suggestions on what to do next. But um, so the campaign, um, you're going to have to select an ad account if you want to create a campaign. And it depends on if you're on a um, MCC account, so My Client Center account. So if you have clients and you're running ads for multiple clients, you're going to be you're going to have to select an account to create a campaign. And then so now we've gone through ad groups and now we're at ads. We can create search ads or we can create display ads. And so then it's going to you should set keywords for your ads. So whenever people are searching on Google, if they type certain keywords, like if you're in real estate and they type real estate, um, you want to show up at the top of the search results. So you're going to have to add that as a keyword and you can do so by uploading a CSV file full of keywords. If you want to do it like that, you can. Um, that's a fairly convenient way to do it. Um, so let's see. That's it for uh, this this small little explainer tutorial on how to set up a Google Ads Manager account. And uh, thanks for watching.